The cheat and robin bastard? Those are 50, I'll take 4. For some reason, the incendiary bolts are my chi or my weapon of choice when it comes to a fight. You're 20 each, I'll take a few. I'll go up to 10 and hope I find the rest, or than that, I think I'm pretty good, actually. The bone charms I don't find kind of useful enough to even bother with that. Grenade capacity, just, I don't use the four I've been carrying. Spring Razor capacity, again, I am actually going for non-lethal shit. Crossbow reload, let's do it. Just fucking dump 600 kinds down there. Spring Razor radius, I'll hold on to my money. Right, so we have geared up a little bit. Let's go a small bit further here. And see what Samuel has to say, because we have to go get Sokolov now. Off to Caldwin's bridge, sir. We'll get our sleep later. I fucking doubt that. Wait, 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 wait. I'll be back shortly, bye. I want to see how Emily is settling, settling in. I got confused by the setting sun for a minute there. It happens. She will be... Wow. Come on, man. Come, come on, are you an assassin? <laughs> you want know fucking? I'll take the easy route. Oh, I have to... Oh, I do have to be up there. Good. Let's kind of play it a little bit safe. I can't be running around Vaughn off fucking buildings. Oh, I might want to see if I can get the... Uh, thing for... My mana off of Piero before I head out. Because Ben Time fucking eats that shit. What's that? I don't want to look around right now. Of course. We can give you the tour later when you've rested. I was wondering do you think my mother is really dead? I saw her get stabbed, but maybe she was still alive and got better. Is that possible? I'm sorry, Emily. But no, she did not survive. Oh. Did you go to her funeral? Was it fancy and beautiful? A train of carriages rode through the city. It was very beautiful. Flowers everywhere. And thousands of people wept because they will miss her. I wish I could have seen it. I'm sorry, dear. Again, it really is the little things in this game that I've come to appreciate. There's books in here. I hope I've read them before. Uh, let's do it first. The Fugue Feast sounds like something that I've already read. Yeah, that's the fucking awesome time of year. Brilliant. Whoa, God, no. Oh, I fucking hate dolls. Get rid of them, please, Callista. I saved your uncle. I've been planning for Emily. Lesson plans are together. A schedule is prepared. We will make life as normal as possible here. Wow, is that ain't a concern at this stage? I'm really. The horror she has seen. But all that's almost over. And that makes what the third time I've hit my microphone fucking grievously while sitting down here. Now is my time to show my worth in this coalition. Yeah, I doubt that. I knew this was why they brought me here, but I didn't want to say it out loud lest it not happen. Superstitious, I know. That means you doubted me, and that I could bring her here. Also, you've the eyes of a dark elf in the dark. Hey, Emily, how's things going? I mean, this place isn't as pretty as the Golden Cat, but I like it better anyway. Well, it does have as many bats. You can see the tower across the river from here. That's where my mother died. Sometimes I wonder about the man who stabbed my mother. Who was he? His name was Dowd. I have a great picture of him. Or I did, I've already sold it. So I get to stay in the smaller tower while I live here. That'll be good practice. That's it. Always look on the bright like side. Samuel. Perhaps we can take another boat ride soon. Yeah, I won't go take any boat rides with Sammy. Not that I don't trust the man, but... Let's be honest, I don't trust the man. Alright, well look, one fall didn't kill me. Didn't even hurt. 
Shrugging it off like a boss. Ask me for any gear you need. Like a master assassin or here. Uh, we already have the max, so I'm going to waste everyone's fucking time here. Include my own, and I have precious little of it. Because if anybody's curious, it is 1.35 in the morning or here. And I have work tomorrow. So that's not good. Go ahead. Let's keep on going for the moment. Alright, Sam. I have returned. Off to Caldwin's bridge, sir. We'll get our sleep later. Do you just have a pet fish that follows you around? He's always back there. I'm ready to go find Sokolov, the royal physician. Just climb aboard when you're ready. I'm back on the mask goes. I took it off about fucking 20 minutes ago. And that is actually the bridge I was looking at when I was standing talking with Pendleton. Now that I think about it, it is also the one that was featured in the painting in the Golden Cat. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Groups of rats are attracted to corpses. Isn't that always the way? You've been asked to abduct Anton Sokolov, the royal physician, head of the Academy of Natural Philosophy. Your new allies want to obtain from Sokolov the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. A mysterious ally and one of the most powerful noble supporters Sokolov lives. Man, I just, wow. In a large apartment somewhere atop Caldwin's Bridge. Good. I can barely read. Let's see how I do it. Sneaking. What do you think? Caldwin Bridge. You've been in the city for years, but you lived in Dunwall Tower with the late Empress, so maybe you haven't visited the bridge before tonight. Something to look out for. See all them lights on the water? That's right. We'll be spotted for sure. You're gonna have to shut off their power before I can pick you up. How convenient. Now, about bringing Sokolov back alive, he's smart. Maybe even smarter than Piero. Got the whole of Dunwall under his thumb with all that natural philosophy business. New technology, potions and the like. Seems dangerous to me. But what do I know? Not a whole lot, Samuel. Here we Not are. a whole lot. I'll meet you at the arches under Sokolov's place when you're ready, Corvo. Assuming, of course, you've taken care of those floodlights. Yeah, yeah, I get to take care of the floodlights. Whatever. I'll do it or I won't. That's your problem. I'm already out here looking for shit to rob. Not that I have anything in mind to spend the money on, but it's always nice to have it. Wow, the game just became really choppy. And there goes Samuel. Off to be a hero elsewhere. Don't get given any uh, boat rides young ladies now. That's a chain. I should probably take this chain. There's even a ramp leading up to it. Right. Let's see how badly I fucked this. Yeah, good, good. Where the fish to eat me? Oh, come on. I fucking pressed X. Held it too. Curfew means ain't nobody allowed to be just wandering about. Chase him down, and you give him a severely deadly beating, is what? Okay, yeah, I got it. No point. Severely deadly. Okay, what does that say? Ah, uh, the usual, uh, overseer bullshit. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of... The curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens. No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. 
Ah, I saw some green ore there. It's weirdly selective about the angle it will let me see it, but that doesn't change the fact that it's there. For rent. Ha! Right, we only have three guards here. Whoa, I can go all the way over there. Beautiful. I'm just going very quickly see if there's any loot work going for over here. No, there is not. Right. I want this loot. Yeah, because that is like copper wire or some shit. Are you going to leave, sir? Please. This is way too early to start using sleep darts. You're, you're a fucking ass is what you are. Oh god, forgot about that one. Oh man. Give me all the good stuff. Up and over. Sweet. Right, where am I going? Not there. Right. So, oh no. I remember I fucking tried to go on them before and I kept falling off. Not in this playthrough, but in our ones. Yep, there is a doorway right in that corner. Do I want to get into? True there is the path of victory. <coughs> Thank fuck I didn't go there, but look, if I start playing a little bit smarter, no one needs to die. No one. I can smell you from here. There we go. Progress made. Not one dead person yet. Right, well look, the fact that Sokolov has to be taken alive means that no one has to die this time. There's a catwalk overhead that I'd like to get onto if I can. And it looks like I can. I dare not close enough to be worried about just yet. Oh, I remember this! Sweet. You know, I'm probably going to end up doubling back. The game keeps skipping frames every once in a while there. Again, good. Right. Whoa, full of Galvani resin. Boot stealth one. Alright. That should actually come in handy. Close that shit or don't start breaking bottles. Okay, yeah, this shit is awesome. I'm gonna ride it. But at the same time, like I was uh, saying for two seconds there, is there still blood? There's still blood on my blade. Of course there is. There we go. Yeah, I'll probably end up doubling back in search of goodies. What the fuck does that achieve? Huh. That I don't get. I told it to open up the... The gate. Apparently not. Right, clearly we need the whale oil. Oh. So I could swing over there. I really don't see why that is ever even a thing. 
because even if you've standard blink, you should be able to make that gap. No, no, game's weird. <laughs> I heard somebody down there on our night. On our patrol with you. Alright, let's not electrocute ourselves somehow. This shit is awesome. I will save though, because yeah, it was a long time ago before I actually saved. Back in the uh, House of Pleasure. Right, there's a guy all the way down there scratching himself. <laughs> Probably, yeah. 64 meters. But the, yeah. Okay, on the other side of the street. That's uh, fine. Where's this lever? Here we go. And now the game has become Minecraft. That's a fucking beautiful scene. Simply beautiful. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the region, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens. No pedestrian movement hmm. is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge. Can I make it? I can. That was beautiful. Tomorrow morning at Absolutely beautiful. Flawless even. Collect all the loot I can. Wow. Even that's better than the fucking place I nearly got stuck in. Back in the car house. <laughs> right, I can only get that from the other side, so... We will endeavor to do just that. Yeah, when I scared the two girls in the golden car, and they ran off and came back with the guards, you know that little place? Those guards found me in quite a fucking shitty little corner of the... Oh no. Of the establishment. Almost got card. In the crapper. Oh my god, really? I couldn't do this when the drop was over a fucking... When the drop was only five foot. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Sweet. Oh, I hate how this fucking thing sways. Makes me nauseous. We have our rune stone in there. We have a dude down there going up there to do something with whatever. Do not know, do not care. Give me my shit. That is one of five. Okay. Hey, it's the exact same painting. Awesome. I really wish I could wipe the blood off this blade. It'd make me feel less uh, self-conscious. Oil release valve. No, oh, what's the best? There's something awesome down there. Is there any other reason to be here? See, that's a way I can go. That leads into that. Oh god. Why do you already have your sword drawn, man? <clears throat> Nobody has seen me. Oh, this... This can't end well. Oil release valve. What does that mean for anyone? Blink might be far enough. I don't even want to go up on the rail. Okay, okay, right. I have found my route. Do that. Yeah, oh, I fucking hate it. I redo really hate it. Wait for the other guy to come back. Shoot him. Let's just see. Yeah, I can totally fucking blink my way down there. He's gonna stop right there. Oh look, I'll hit him before that just in case he sees the other dude. Really, really banking on nobody being just there. 
just in case, let's go onto the wall. 